I hope you're all having a great day today, and welcome back to another vlog. And Happy New Year to you! It is the first day of 2018. Thought that'd be pretty cool to start out the year. <laughs> I don't know. Probably not as uh, eventful or whatever, but can we get a slow motion of that real quick? So as I said, I hope you all are having an amazing day today. When you're watching this, it is the second day of 2018, and I hope that your first day was eventful. I saw a tweet from one of my film inspirations. His name is Ilya M, and today he put out, be mindful of how you spend your first day of 2018, because that will essentially, uh, this is not exactly everything he said, like I'm literally just summarizing it and probably adding words, but that will essentially define your year. Be mindful of how you spend today because that will define your year. So, I hope you got out. I hope you started those small accomplishments. I hope you started the 2018 challenge. That begins here today, guys. Let's do it. Let's have fun with it. Let's put a smile on our face and let's just keep this year friggin' awesome. I cannot wait, as I said last night, to see what 2018 brings to every Come single on. person. Uh, strap, pop. Hot as black top, in that black top Eyes flutter as your back lock Grip tight on your hips like a padlock Is the padlock, I don't know I had strings of bad luck Clear the bed before we crush your laptop Come on beg, come on say my name Like they do at shows, only difference Already feeling so good about the start to this vlog today Even though, as you can see, we are already out of daylight today, my friends like literally I have been just not lazy I've just been running behind today on a lot of things like I did not start today off the way that I wanted to but that is because I was so crammed last night with all the New Year's celebrations and editing the main channel video and editing the vlog I did not get to bed till 5 a.m. meaning I did not get up till 2 30 in the afternoon that is something definitely that has got to change this year certain nights it's gonna be unavoidable when I'm really putting in work and I'm hitting the grind and that to me is completely understandable to be able to get stuff done sometimes you got to sacrifice something else which kind of does suck because I wasted most of my day away today but still got a lot of editing to do on the main channel video got to get all of this confetti cleaned up and stuff like that and got to start planning stuff for next weekend because this baby comes down next weekend so I got to start figuring out storage tubs and stuff like that because I got a box but I want to get rid of that and I want to get a bag to put it in because it's going to be so much better than the box because that's falling apart. <laughs> also, you can probably tell by now, but rocking the new white dad hat, it has been over a year since I have been able to rock a white dad hat because for one, I just stopped wearing it. I got bored of it, you know, the whole change thing with me and then it just got ruined because I don't know what happened. It just started like mildew or whatever on it and I'm just like, crap. So this hat, I'm going to definitely take a lot better care of and then when I get the rose hat and I get the praying hands at those are gonna get taken care of just as like well or good I don't know proper words right now like I will take care of them like I take care of the Versal Alto hat like I baby that thing and you're probably thinking to yourself it's a little weird that you just talked about babying a hat well the thing is I love collecting hats like some people love collecting shoes some people love collecting stamps or whatever else other people collect I collect house trucks as well like you guys see I get those every single Christmas or I'll get them on my birthday but like I started collecting hats hats a few years ago it started with like maybe one or two and you know I loved wearing hats as a kid and stuff like that but then as I got into high school and out of high school I just started buying more and more hats and I think it got to a point where I had almost 20 hats that I could choose from on any different day been putting my nose to the grindstone over the last couple of hours almost to the end of this main channel video right now the 2017 recap video I hope you guys are really excited for this I cannot wait for it to come out it looks so good right now probably looking at this coming out before this vlog right here tomorrow so be prepared for it you know link is going to be down in the description below it is now time to stop and take a little bit of a break from editing to sit down and enjoy a nice new year's dinner 
we have got some really awesome food here. This just looks amazing. I'm staring at my plate right now and I'm just like ready to start salivating. Like it looks so good. This is what we got going on for dinner right here. We got a pork roast here covered in gravy, mashed potatoes, sweet potatoes, corn, and a biscuit all covered in gravy. Like, wow, this looks freaking amazing. I cannot wait to dig in. I made a vow to change the game. Incomparable, we didn't say the same. I'm riding for a meaning, y'all just riding for the fame. Honestly, I'm thanking God for everything that I became. I could probably be like you, but I've always been different. Only riding music so but you ride only when you're lifted up. I know I'm gifted, but it wasn't given. That was in my room way before they ever gave attention. I can bet you anything I am not the only YouTuber to see this today from Dick Clark Productions. It's crazy that we can't even film something as simple as the ball dropping on New Year's Eve without worrying about getting a copyright claim. And like, this is the stupidest thing ever, but it's also the most genius thing ever because they could easily just be like, oh, we're gonna take your video down, you have to delete it, you can't upload it with that in there. But instead, it's just like, no, we're gonna let them keep the video up so we can make all the money off of it. Like, great business idea, but sucks for me. Now, obviously, I talk about all the time, I don't do YouTube for the money, I do it for the fun, but I just think about all the other YouTubers that go through this same thing all the time, and like, they're doing this as a career. It's how they basically make a living. They don't have any other jobs or whatever, so it's just like, really crappy for them, and like, in the future, my whole goal is to make a career out of this with filmmaking and stuff like that, and to be able to one day support myself off of YouTube, and like, stuff like this happening just really gets on my nerves for me and for the entirety of the community. After about probably four to five hours of work today, just finished up the 2017 recap video. It is over 13 minutes long. Gonna wait to render this till tomorrow because I won't be able to take the memory card out of the computer and then I won't be able to edit this vlog tonight. So just fair warning, this video will be up tomorrow though. So be looking forward to that. Hopefully, as I said, it'll be up before this vlog goes out, so check to see if there's a link in the description below. There should be. Nobody gonna tell me to stop, can't you see? I do what I want, I'm feeling high. High, feeling high, so high. It's easy to keep moving along, can't you see? I do what I want. So I have had this sign for a while, it's actually a sticker. This is actually a pain in the butt to put on the computer right here. First off, I didn't know where to put it because there's literally no other space on the back of my computer that this would fit. And second off, it came on this sort of like stencil and all the letters were stuck on the other side of this like sticker part. And you had to peel this off without the letters peeling off on here and then get them to stick on the computer. But I just love it, it's like rainbow color changes. It is awesome. And the first day of 2018 is officially over. You got 364 or more to go, my friends. And let's make each and every one of them just as good as the last. Make it better than the day before. Keep that mindset every day when you wake up that you've gotta be a better version of the person you were yesterday. You've always gotta sort of try to one-up yourself and see what you can do on that specific day and like that is a great mindset to have to keep positive thoughts and just really have fun there'll probably be a few struggles here and there in 2018 but just work through them and that is really what it's gonna take to just be a better version of you i know for me today was not exactly how i wanted to start out my day it got started later but that was because i was grinding it out last night till five in the morning working on videos and that's what sucks about it that's something i gotta change something I want to change so that way I'm not up that late so I can get up and I can have everything done before 12 o'clock in the afternoon and then I can get out especially when it's warm and adventure and do stuff and not be home and be bored and like crawling in my skin like I gotta do something like I'm going crazy or wild or nuts or whatever like I can't sit around and do nothing I have to be doing something so this is gonna be really good being a better version of myself is all gonna be on me how 2018 turns out for me is all gonna be on on me. It's going to be based on whether or not I want to get off my lazy butt and create an adventure and just have fun with the vlog, with my other YouTube channel, and with just life in general. God.
some really awesome stuff to take care of tomorrow. Grind does not stop with the YouTube channel. Gonna be working on main channel videos for literally weeks and weeks out. Like I am trying to plan everything out all the way literally until May at this point. Like I wanna be that prepared so that way I have a video for you guys every single week on the main channel. It is going to be absolutely awesome. And then tomorrow is also awesome because it's gonna finally be in the 20s. <laughs> literally, yeah, it's a heat wave around here. It's not gonna be negative whatever. It's We're actually gonna get a warm up for three days and then it's just gonna go poof again for like two more days. And then it's supposed to go back up into the 30s next week sometime. But that means we're probably gonna get snow. Actually, they're saying we're gonna get snow. So I don't know how much, but I'll take a tiny bit of snow for 30 degree temperatures rather than whatever the hell we've had for the last week. But that is pretty much gonna wrap it up for today, guys. I wanna thank you so much for watching because I really do appreciate it. I also wanna thank you for coming with me into 2018. I wanna welcome any brand new viewers that are here right now. I love it that you found my videos and I hope that you come back for more. If you enjoyed this and you so decide to slap a like on it, don't forget to turn those post notifications on down below so that way you never miss when I upload a brand new video to this channel. Also, while you're down there, if you haven't already, and I do not understand why you haven't, click that big red subscribe button so that way you get subscribed to all of the awesomeness that MJC Vlogs is. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with another brand new daily vlog. Remember to stay awesome, keep smiling, you're beautiful, and I love you guys so much. Peace out, you too. I think I'm falling for my side. 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 Now I really wanna kick it. I get.